Have you ever thought about having a second New Year's? Maybe your New Year's resolutions didn't go to plan. Or you just want to feel the adrenaline of welcoming in the new year again. Well, look no further, because this is the place for you. Or video. But before you start your festivities, here are a few things you need to know about the Vietnamese New Year. And that is wishing, otherwise known as chup that. So how do you wish? Firstly, I would address myself. So if I'm speaking to someone who is older than me, I would say gong. And then I would say chup means to wish. And then I would address the person who I'm wishing. So gong chup om noi, which is I wish grandpa. And then the wish itself. Or if I'm speaking to a friend, I would say bang chup bang or bang chup and then their name. You've probably heard this one before. Chup mung nam mai means happy new year. Chup mung means congratulations. Nam means year and mai means new. You'll probably use this when talking to someone formally. Maybe your mum, dad, uncle, auntie, grandparents, or maybe even that lady who makes you that great bun mi. Try it on her next time. She might give you a freebie. This next line is Nam moi vui ve. It also means Happy New Year. It's more of a casual way to say it. Probably with your friends, maybe you're catching up with them at a dirt festival, you see them coming and you're like, Chuk mong nam moi vui ve. Som lao jam toi. This means to live for a hundred years. This is usually used by kids or someone younger for someone who is older. So wishing your grandparents, mum, dad, for example, aunties, uncles, but maybe not use it if they're almost up to 100 years old because you'd be wishing for them to be in the deathbed soon, which isn't good. This is used for elderly people to wish for their bones to be stronger than stones. It means abundant health. You might wish this to someone who's a little bit under the weather. I love this one. Jeremai kom ya. It means do not age and stay young. You can add in an extra mai if you want to sound snappy. Jeremai mai kom ya. Viet aunties love this one because, you know, they want to stay beautiful forever. Tan kom jom moi mac. It means to be successful in all aspects. This pretty much covers all the wishes you want to say. I could say that I wish you to have a happy life, be successful, have a lot of money, or I can just say Tan kom chom moi mac. Tiền vô như nước, tiền ra như nhỏ giọt cà phê. Well, that sounds good. It means money comes in like water, but comes out like Vietnamese drip coffee. Oh yeah. I would probably say this to someone who's a bit older than me. Uncles, aunties, someone who is saving up for a business maybe, saving up for a house. Ma dao tan kom. It means to have instant success. Ma means horse. Dao means to run. So may you have instant success like a racing horse. Maybe say this to someone who hasn't had the best year and you want to lift their spirits up a bit. This is the classic one. Vang seng ye i. Hope everything goes as you wish it to. Wish someone who is in year 12, maybe they're doing their VCE or someone who is applying for a new job. This is a simple one. Ya dan han phuc. It means to wish for a happy family. Mao chom tiem được người yêu. This means for a new lover to come in the new year. Wish this for someone who needs a bit of romance in their life. Think about that cousin of yours who always gets interrogated about when they're going to get married. And the next line is... Wait, you guys want me to say this? Oh my god, it's so long. I only got up to year six. I don't... Hãy quên đi những nỗi đau Điều buồn đau đằng sau Wow, so that means forget the pain, sorrows and sadness and leave it in the past Chúng ta hãy đón năm mới này với nụ cười lớn So that means let's welcome in the new year with a big smile Chúc các bạn năm mới It means happy new year This is quite long but you will definitely impress the people that you are wishing. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. Happy New Year! Chúc mừng năm mới!